Welcome everyone. This is Owl Crate May 2021 unboxing. So this is Nikki. Thank you for coming. And I hope you guys all like this. So, first off, of course, we have the beautiful artwork that they do every single month. And the theme for this month is Expect the Unexpected. So let's go ahead and dive in. So first off, we have a bag, corduroy. And it says, may we meet again on distant shores. It has long handles and short handles, zipper on the inside, so very cute. The lovely line featured on our Obsidio inspired corduroy bag was hand lettered by Studio Kyra Calligraphy. It has us craving a reread of the entire Illuminae Files trilogy on a warm beach somewhere. Right. Next up, ooh, Rule of Wolves. Now a crate exclusive. All right. So, we're all monsters. Here's what this scarf says. So it's beautiful. And perpetually tempted to reread the entire Christopher series, constantly rewatching the Shadow and Bode adaptation. We can't get enough either, so we're partnered with our friends at Out of Print to bring you this exclusively, officially licensed Rule of Wolves square scarf. And I actually am rereading the Grisha series right now. Alright. So this box already tells me it's the Owl Crate Collectible t Book Tin, which I love these. Um, I would love to hear what you guys are using yours for. I've been putting tarot decks in mine. So crowned captains, deadly pirate kings, and queens. beautiful tin and I swear they're perfectly fit for a lot of different things on the inside it says I'd rather die on adventure than live standing still and like I said I'm using mine for tarot card decks because I have quite a few I'd love to hear what you guys end up putting in yours So set sail in Grey London with the second release from our four-part collectible book tin series inspired by a darker shade of magic. Forensic and Flowers created the perfect box book that Leela Bard would have certainly nicked for her own bookshelves. Alright, next up. I have a feeling this is a bookmark. I'm kind of hoping so. Yay! Beautiful. I really like how hard it is, but thin. I kind of feel like this is metal. All right. So here's the quote on the front. And then this is what it says on the back. It's a beautiful bookmark. So it says here, Pixel and Ink Creative plucked two quotes full of hope from the pages of Scythe and the Fifth Season to highlight when creating this metal tassel bookmark. We hope they resonate with you as well. Okay. And next up, we do have the pin that comes every single month. So. Here's 
a better look at that. So it says, logic ends where love begins. Icy Designs took inspiration from the gorgeously striking cover when designing the pin for the ones we're meant to find. It's a front runner for our favorite design released so far in our 2021 collaboration with artist Hafsa Bazal. I had to get a little bit organized and it looks like I'm missing something from this owl crate box, which is the first time ever. But it says that there was a vinyl sticker, and I don't have one in my box. So it did say fans of the Gilded Wolves should recognize the quote that the lion in the trees featured in her bold design of this vinyl sticker. Now, if only we could decide on the perfect place to stick it. And it's really unfortunate because I love the Gilded Wolves. Okay. But the main reason why I get Owl Grey is, of course, the book. So the book this month is The Ones We're Meant to Find by Joan He. And Owl Crate always has an exclusive signed edition. Go ahead, and there it is. There's the signature. It also comes with a letter from the author. I always love reading those before I start the book. So it says, The ones we're meant to find is the twisty young adult page turner that we didn't know we needed until we had this beautiful story in our hands. It's We Were Liars meets Black Mirror with a dash of Studio Ghibli thrown in. Our signed special edition comes with an exclusive cover and exclusive foil designs on the hot hardcover case. Joan He also wrote an author letter just for our Crate subscribers. I love that the inside of the foil design. I'm not going to lie, I always take off the covers whenever I'm reading hardback books, so I'm glad that when a hardback book has a design on it. Makes me happy. Okay. All right, the last part of the May 2021 box from Alquay is the little booklet that comes inside. It does include an interview with the author, as well as the difference between the Alquay cover and the regular cover. It does look like there's a fun test. What Grisha order do you belong in? It also comes with an interview with one of the vendors. And then information about how to do the photo challenge and gives you, you know, a few titles of books that are coming out this month as well that they're excited for. That's the booklet. There is the theme for the June boxes announced. It's Go Your Own Way. Sneak peek is every June box will include an NML item from Pineapple Sundays. And it says the item is not a keychain, it's something we've never sent in a box before. So go your own way. So the June unboxing will be, of course, here with Nikki Loves Books. I hope you will join me. So thank you everyone for joining me for the May 2021 unboxing of Owl Crate with the theme Expect the Unexpected. Please, you know, the usual drill, subscribe, like, share, whatever you want to do, whatever you're comfortable with. I hope you'll join me again for another unboxing come June. I will be posting it basically as soon as I get the box, so no more me being behind. Also, if you subscribe, look forward to my book reviews coming. All right, thanks. Bye.